Welcome to this video on using the CSP library. If you're new to CSP or need a refresher on using a university library, this video will give you an introduction about how the CSP library is organized and the different resources available to students. Over the course of this video, we'll walk through the library's main search tool, also known as OneSearch, when to use and how to access subject-specific databases, finding quick research assistance in our subject guides, and how to contact a librarian for assistance. To jump straight to any of these four topics, use the timestamps included in the progress bar of this video. The most straightforward way to find resources in the library is through the main search, known as OneSearch. The library's collection is full of electronic resources like scholarly articles, videos, business reports, and magazine articles, which you may not see using a search engine like Google. Using OneSearch lets you search everything in the library's collection at once, which can be a great way to get a sense of what kinds of resources are available. To use OneSearch, start from the library's homepage, library.csp.edu. Look for the search bar in the center of the page, type in a few search terms related to your topic, and then hit the search button. This will take you to a results page, where you can browse through different types of resources. To help reduce the sheer number of results, use the filtering options on the left to limit to just a particular type of resource, such as a peer-reviewed article, or by publication date. When you find an item that interests you, click on the title, and then click on any of the available links to access the full article in a database. While using OneSearch conveniently searches everything in a library's collection at once, the number of results can sometimes be overwhelming, often in the tens of thousands to million plus range. In those cases, it might be more beneficial to search in a smaller, more focused pool of resources rather than wading through an ocean of results in one search. That's where library databases come in. Databases are collections of resources, typically articles, that often focus on specific subjects, such as business, education, or psychology. Searching in these collections gives you more control over what you see and gives you some peace of mind that everything will at least be generally related to what you're looking for. To access specific databases, Start again from the library's homepage, library.csp.edu. Instead of typing in the OneSearch bar, click on the Databases tab just above it. You have a couple options here. If you know the title of the database you're looking for, click on the letter that it starts with. More likely, you'll want to see all the databases that deal with a particular subject area. For example, clicking on Business and Management will bring you to a page with links to different databases that include business resources. At the top is a Best Bets section which includes a few databases librarians highly recommend. Each database has a general purpose that can help with different aspects of your research. The first two, ABI Inform and Business Source Ultimate, are article databases and are great places to search for peer-reviewed articles, trade journal articles, and magazine and newspaper articles, also known as popular articles. Hoover's specializes in company research. Ibisworld has collections of industry reports, and Statista is a great place to find statistics. As you move through different classes and encounter assignments that ask you for different types of information, these databases should help you find what you need. Each database might look a little different, but they often operate the same way. Just like in OneSearch, check out the limiting tools built into each database to focus your searches, such as only displaying scholarly journals and articles published in the last few years. Also be sure to save yourself some time by using the Cite tool to quickly generate a citation that you can copy and paste into your assignment. If you've looked through some library resources and aren't sure where to start, consider looking at a subject guide. Librarians put together these tailored pages to help you better navigate the resources available and offer you some general tips on how to be a smarter and more efficient searcher. You'll generally find two types of guides. Guides that offer research guidance on a general topic, and guides that help with specific classes and assignments. To see a list of subject guides, start again from the library homepage, library.csp.edu. Above the One Search bar and next to the Databases button, click on the Subject Guides button and choose the subject you're looking for. In this case, we'll focus on business and management. You should now see a list of all the available subject guides on this topic. If you are in MBA or Human Resource Management programs, the MBA or Human Resources subject guides might help you better navigate better resources on those topics. Or if you're a student in Marketing 301, there's a course guide to help with research for the assignments in that course. 
in this case, identifying a target market and conducting environmental scans. You'll find links to specific library resources, as well as some guidance on how best to plan and actually go about doing the research. You can also find guides tailored to each course in Blackboard. Check them out either within the Student Resources folder, under the Library Resources link, or linked in certain assignments or discussion board prompts that ask you to cite sources in your response. These course guides offer quick access to some frequently used resources, and some tips for using the tools more efficiently. As you continue searching, there may come a time when you need some help. The quickest and easiest way to speak with a librarian is through a 24-7 chat service, which you can find embedded on just about every library page. It's a great way to get quick advice, whether you're not finding what you expect to, or you're wondering how to cite a specific resource. If you prefer, you can also contact the library by email, phone, or stop by campus in person to work directly with the librarian. If you want to talk to someone directly, you can also email or schedule an appointment with the librarian who works with your program. Look for a profile box for the picture of a librarian, either while accessing databases or subject guides, or in any of the guides themselves, and select the option you prefer. Librarians are available to meet on campus or over a video call, whichever works best for you. Hopefully you now feel more confident using the library. If you need help with something on a more detailed topic, check out other library videos, including tips for finding articles and searching for company and industry research. Let us know if you have any other questions as you use the library, and as always, thanks for listening!